Nice little walleye. Hi, I'm Ted Takasaki with Perry Parks, my buddy. We're with Midwest Outdoors on Devil's Lake, North Dakota. We're trying to hit the nighttime or the evening bite. We just got set up. Let's see how we do today. Here, I'll help you out here. Oh, oh. oh there he is. Oh. All right. Thanks, Ted. You betcha. I tell you what. You know, it might be a small fish, but there's a lot of people that would love to have a fish like that. <laughs> We're hitting that magical hour of dusk, and these walleyes are going to start turning on. I mean, this is a great sign. We're getting the small fish. Let's hope the big ones come start piling in here and see if we can get them. Oh, man, he thumped it there. I don't know. That oh, little guy. Yeah, he took that minnow head. Yeah, folks, I'm using a jigging wrap today. It's got a, I use a minnow head down on the treble. This is a green with gold. I put a little red stripe on the side. Yeah, the fish uh, have been real aggressive so far this evening. So they like this jigging wrap. When you jig it, it swims out and turns, and then it comes back. And then you kind of just set it there and quivered a little bit. Now I like to hold it about a foot off the bottom, sometimes a foot and a half. Fish on. Hey, I'll help you. <coughs> All right, there you go. Nice another, you betcha, another nice, nice little, little walleye. You know, what we're doing here tonight is working baits a little bit more aggressively. Uh, the rattle baits, the jig and wrap type of baits. You know, you wanna try to bring those fish in, create some motion, and uh, in these low light periods, walleyes will typically feed a lot more aggressively. So that's where you wanna really pump that bait a little bit harder. And that's yep. pretty, pretty much what they you've been doing. A high jig coming down, so right. hit it like, hit it really hard, so. Awesome. Oh, there you go. Oh, yeah. God, that fish absolutely slammed that bait. I mean, I'm talking, I'm talking it was an aggressive, aggressive bite. Oh yeah, look at that. Oh my God, nicest fish of the night. You know, I mean, that's the whole thing. You know, during that night bite, you know, we were looking around trying to find these smaller fish. I just knew one of them bigger fish were gonna hit sometime this evening. That is one beauty of a fish. I tell you what, out here on Devil's Lake, it's a small window of opportunity. It's early in the morning, late in the evening, but this is definitely something that you have to do and stay on the water early and late. Man, that one smoked it, Ted. <laughs> oh, hey, let me help you. Yeah, very, Thanks, get Teddy. this transistor out of the way. They always seem, oh, there you go. Another nice one. Oh yeah. Oh They're baby. In. They're moving you betcha. In. <laughs> it's that it's that short little window in the evening that makes all the difference in the world. I mean, we were scratching our heads for a little bit, and that's two real quick fish. <laughs> no, all they're right. definitely coming, Teddy. They're well, I tell you in. what, you had them hooked really good there, Perry. What a beauty. Unbelievable. I tell you what, Perry, let's try catching a couple more. Let's go clean them. Look at oh, there he is. Hey, you need some help? Yeah. <laughs> God, all no I'm doing is helping you, man. <laughs> I'm glad you're Perry, here, buddy. <laughs> Perry is hot tonight. I haven't done all that. Oh, nice, oh, yeah. Yeah, nice fish. Good job, Another Ted. beauty. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Nice, yeah. nice walleye. I tell you what, you know what I mean? Again, this evening bite, you know what I mean? It's, it's the key. Yep. The low light periods, these walleyes, they have superior eyesight and uh, they feed much more aggra aggr aggressively and, and actively at night. So. No. Yeah, that one really smoked it. Look at, he's got that oh, yeah, he come got... right in and hit it right in the middle of the water. <laughs> he was after that minnow hat. <laughs> yeah. We had a fun walleye bite this evening. Even though it was a short window, we caught some fish, had a great time. So let's go ahead and clean, clean a few fish and let's show them how the skins it works. All right, Ted. Well, this is the new skins it from Ultimate Fishing Gear. I'm going to demonstrate on how, how to clean some of our walleyes tonight that we caught. So you just clamp this lever, and this throttle activates it. 
So I'm gonna remove the rib bones. You wanna make sure you always start on the wide end of the fly, the head end. So I'm gonna demonstrate one here. So you clamp it, start it, and move in. And there's the rib bone. No meat left on that at all. Now you fl flip your fly over, and you wanna start on the wide end again. You lay your unit flat, clamp it, start it, and move in. Now notice at the end, I just clamp and pull, and there's your fly. Perry, this Kinsey, that's absolutely awesome. I mean, it's fast, fun, and easy to use. Where do people find out about the Kinsey? Ted, the best way is just to go to fishskinner.com. This is Ted Takasaki and Perry Parks at Midwest Outdoors. We'll be right back.